Welcome back to FLA Labs. Today we're going to be printing this neat little fidget toy that I designed to learn about printing gears. First, you'll want to head over to my Thingiverse account and download the files. There you'll find four files to download. One for the base plate, one for the medium gear, one for the small gear, and one for the covers. Download them all to your machine, and then open up your slicer. First, we want to slice the base plate, along with two of the covers, one for each gear. I've positioned them on the build plate here to print one at a time, Now I'll clear the build plate and I'll bring in the STLs for the small gear and the medium gear. Again, I'll position them on the build plate so that they can be printed one at a time. Once the parts are positioned, slice them and save them to your computer. I'm still using Octoprint to control my 3D printer, so for me, I need to drag those two G-code files into my Octoprint server. And press start. I decided to go ahead and print all the color combinations that I had, but in this video, I'm going to assemble the green and blue option. inspecting each piece for print defects. We'll be using these bearings I got on Amazon. I've used them in some other projects and I'll link them in the description. We'll also be using this super glue. I recommend using an activator spray for instant curing. Apply the glue to the gear and press in the ball bearings. Be sure that the bearings are pressed in flush so that the gear will spin evenly. Now we test the bearing to make sure the glue hasn't caused it to seize and install it on the base plate. Test that the bearing spins freely on the base plate. Now it's time to add the small gear. Align the gear teeth and press the bearing into place. properly and spin freely. Be sure that both bearings are seated completely. Now it's time to install the bearing covers. If you prefer the look of the fidget toy without the bearing covers, skip this step. Apply a dot of glue into the centering hole, insert the cover, and apply pressure while the glue dries. That's it. The fidget toy is completely assembled. Let's take a look at how it turned out.
thanks for watching this video about how to print and assemble your own fidget toy. Be sure to subscribe for more projects like this and like this video so other people will find it too.